We know that any function can be minimized to either sum of products or product of sums. For example, if, if it is a sum of products, then how does it look like if you minimize a function? Let us say uh, it is a function of A, B, C, D. A, B, C, D. And when you minimize it, assume that the sum of products we got is A, B plus C, D, something like this. Then if you look at this function, it is nothing but ORing of AND terms. So before applying the OR, you are supposed to apply the AND, right? Therefore, you use the AND gate and then you AND them and let the output come, right? Let the output come and then you are going to OR them, right? Therefore, any function which is in sum of products is easy to represent using uh, and or realization. It is also called as and or realization, right? Therefore, sum of products it is easy to realize using and or, right? And if you have a you know negative terms here, it is just a you know simple thing. If you have a prime, then you put a not get here. We are not going to count that not get anyway. So I mean not get is very simple. There is nothing much in it. So we don't care that much. But then and and or this is also called as and or. Even if you have a not. It is simply and or realization. The name is and or. Hmm? And one other way to represent a function is, as you know, product of sums. For example, I can have f of a, b, c, d as product of two sums, a plus b into c plus d, right? Then, how can I represent it? See, it is nothing but oring, anding of or terms. So before you put the AND, you are supposed to OR them, right? Therefore, the best way to implement is first you OR them, ORing means using the OR gate and let the output come out, both the functions, first you OR them, let the output come out and now take the output and you apply the AND, right? So these two are the popular methods. One is and or other is this is also called as or and or and realization right so any function can be implemented like this you take any function it can be written as you know uh, sum of terms or product like this but only thing you should uh, think you know keep in mind here is how many inputs are you going to give to one one gate that is called as fan in fan in means how many inputs are going to come so if you have let us say here a b c right and if you want to realize it in only two levels, so realizing it in two levels is possible only when you have any any number of fan in. For example, if I have here A, B, C plus C, D, something like this, in order to implement A, B, C, you have to give the input as C also, right? In this case, we have fan in as two, right? And if you want to have fan in as, uh, you know, two only, then maybe you will not be able to uh, uh, you know implement it in two levels first thing is you might have to and a b and then and the resulting with c for example if you have only two levels here i mean fan is only two and if you have three terms a into b into c then maybe you would like to have a and get like this and then b c right or you could you could either put you know a b together and then c or a c together and then b it is up to you but anyway what i mean to say is Depending on the fan in of the gates, right, uh, the levels, number of levels are going to de de depend. But then, if you try to increase the fan in of the gates, the cost is going to be increased. See, uh, two input uh, AND gate is cheaper than three input, and then it is cheaper than four input, like that. So, if you want to implement it in less number of levels, you need a like this. What I mean to say is, if you don't want to use two levels of ANDs, you could have gone for a three way I mean uh, fan in of three for AND gate but the problem is it is going to be costly when compared to this right but if you go with this it is going to be faster because the number of levels are less see the overall time requi required depends on the number of levels the signal has to pass through if you are increasing the number of levels the cost is going to be less right but then uh, but then the sorry if you increase the number of levels the cost is going to be less but then it is going to be slower but if you increase the you know, fan level, fan in, the cost is going to be high, definitely, but then it is going to be faster. So it is up to you to decide about it. And in our most of the exa you know, examples, we are going to take with only 
two fan in we suppose that every gate is going to have only two inputs that is why we take the fan in as two and every output is going to be one so sometimes what you could do what you could have is you can have two outputs like this fan out fan out so generally most of the circuits will have fan out as one only so don't worry about it fan out we don't consider fan in we are taking it to be two unless specified so if they don't specify anything you think that fan in is two if they specify something then you think that you know you, can, you have to take that accordingly and then you have to solve it right so any anything can be implemented like this now let's see then uh, let us say i have to implement a function then how many gates as a manufacturer i should produce let us say i have to implement uh, a function like this a prime b plus cd a function like this then how many gates are actually needed one gate is and gate two gates of and are required and one gate is or gate or gate is required and other gate is not to negate it i need the not gate right these many gates are required in order to implement this function right and how many and gates are required i think two right and how many or gates are required one and how many not gate is required one therefore as a manufacturer i have to produce one is and other is or and other is not how many do i have to produce like should i produce thousand 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 is there is a guarantee that every everything is going to be used equally there is no guarantee right so sometimes some people will use more and if the entire world keeps on using more and gates than or gates then the or gates will remain at every factory isn't it therefore maybe using some other way if i use only one single gate and if i could implement anything possible hmm, that will be beneficial the reason is you know you, you keep on producing only that gate therefore the cost of manufacturing is going to come down and then you can put them together and you can implement any circuit right so i want such a gate which i produce one that should be able to implement everything right so just watch this we know that every function can will have a sum of products expression therefore every function can be implemented as a and or realization now let's see using this and or realization can we convert it into a common gate hmm? just watch it assume that i have two gates like this three gates there is a or gate here hmm now i want to i will i want to negate it here output and negate it here and before it is given to the next gate i want to again negate it here and negate it here will the function change it will not change because see whatever you negated hit whatever you complemented again you are complementing back a complement whole complement is a therefore whatever is the function output here the same output is going to appear here and whatever is the output here the same output will be given to this gate so putting a putting a bubble here and putting a bubble here does not hurt anything everything is going to remain same right now by using such a thing what is the advantage we get really huh? see this if i have a or gate or gate to which i am going to negate the inputs and give it if it is a and if it is b let's see what is the output it is a prime plus b prime right how can you write it a b whole prime therefore writing like this is again an and gate isn't it it is not an isn't it it is a not gate right so i could replace this particular gate with one more nand gate so if you are understanding this what i could do it is see i bubble it here and i bubble it here bubble it here and bubble it here then i got this now i'm saying that this is simply a nand gate so i could have replaced this entire part including these two bubbles also they will also go into it entire part could be replaced with nand gate which means i could have written it like this that's it right therefore what did you find out anything in the world any function in the world could be now just implemented using one gate right which is nothing but nand gate so using nand gate you could get not also how can you get a not using nand gate see this if you want to negate something you you want a complement then what you do is simply you give a here and a here then what is that you are getting 
a complement therefore not is also implemented and any function is implemented if i want to implement a prime b plus b c then what i do is first i will complement a like this and then i'll take that input and i'll give it to the and or realization that and or realization is again realized by nand nand realization therefore and or any and or realization can be realized see realization is nothing but implementation instead of saying implementation in this subject i'll be using the term realization so realization means you just understand that we are going to implement a function using the gets that is called realization and or realization is also called as nand nand realization so what is nand nand like this which are we have seen here right it is nand nand realization so what do you understand now you need not manufacture and get or get and not get and you need not worry about how many to manufacture if you are a manufacturer you manufacture in bulk nand gates and using that any function can be implemented therefore any any circuit devisor designer if you have to buy buy some gates from you you just make them only nand gates and give them they can implement anything right so why do you think that is working because nand is nothing but if you look at nand nand is a combination of and gate and not gate and we have already seen that and and when compared with not is a functionally complete set that is why we wanted the functional complete set there right so i mean even though there is no relationship between this concept and that concept that is fishing theory which is applied here there the functionally complete concept is going to be useful here in order to decide about what are the gates which are going to be sufficient to manufacture anything therefore using that theory we already have shown that using a and gate and not not gate they are functionally complete therefore you could go with uh, just the nand gate to implement anything similarly the same logic can be applied for or or and realization if i have or and realization what you could have done is here you could put a bubble put a bubble and put a bubble and put a bubble therefore the meaning doesn't change the function is as it is right and now if you observe this only this particular gate right so how does it look like there is a and gate with this right now what is this if you give a b it is if you give a b it is going to be a prime dot b prime now other way to write it is a plus b whole prime therefore it is going to again act as a nor gate so you could have replaced this with a nor gate right therefore what did you understand now any function can be re represented as product of sums and any product of sums can be implemented as or and therefore it can be converted to nor nor gate so anything can be implemented using nor nor realization right anything now we have just seen that or and can be realized with nor nor what if you want to use only as you know, not gate so if i have only nor gate and if i want to use it as not then simply you give both of the inputs as a then what do i get a plus a whole prime which is nothing but a prime therefore not is possible and any combination of or and or and is possible so or and realization is equivalent to nor nor realization and then and or realization is equivalent to nand nand realization why does this one work the same reason because or and not both are functionally complete these two operations are functionally complete in switching theory therefore these two gates are functionally complete to implement any device in logic design understood this so switching theory is again applied here right so one thing i want to tell you is all the manufacturers in the world they are now confined themselves to building only nand gate or nor gate so either you can the reason is simple either you buy everything nor gate and write the logic and implement it or you know nand gate and write it and implement it both works right now using these building blocks we are going to design some other devices and using those devices we are going to design the real time machines like our computers and all of our everything mobile phone everything will be built from the second level of message you know uh, these machines now the main concept is how many nand gates are required in order to design a circuit so that is, these kind of questions will be possible they will give you a function and now they will ask you if you want to implement it in terms of nand gates and nor gates how many gates you are supposed to use we try we want to minimize it as less as possible right so one, why do you want to minimize it is it is not just the cost see recently cost of get, gates have been fallen down to very very less they are very cheap right but then the, if you use, keep on using lots of gates what happened is this circuit 
the circuit will unnecessarily grow in size on which you are going to put the gates isn't it so if you want to minimize the circuit size by small is beautiful right so if you want to decrease the size of it right then you are going to decrease the number of gates and moreover if you have lots of gates the heat produced will heat uh, the heat you know produced will be very much high so it is not just cost it is the space also that we want to reduce it so for any reason there are lots of reasons we don't we have to reduce the number of gates to as less as possible so next question is instead of talking about how many and gates are required or how many or gates are required uh, we they will be interested in asking about how many minimum nand gates and nor gates are required okay let's see that <coughs> 